This is a review of a digital dance mat with a built-in camera by a company called FWFX. This is the box that it comes in. It cost about 200 bucks on Amazon. This was sent to me for free for review. Also, I have been able to secure a brand new giveaway unit that will be shipped directly from the company to you. That is unfortunately only available in the US, but if you're interested in learning more about that, keep watching. I will share more information towards the end of the video. And by the way, my name is Sean. This is my tech channel where I do unboxing reviews and tutorials of different tech stuff like this. So if you think you will enjoy content like this, you will want to subscribe. Also, I have a ton more free giveaways coming up in my future videos, bunch of speakers and keyboards and things like that. So if you want to make sure not only you won't miss those reviews, but also have the chance to enter in the free giveaway, make sure you change the bell notification to all because that's the only way you'll be notified for my future videos. This thing is pretty big and doing an unboxing and review of it um, and filming it essentially would be a little bit weird and awkward and difficult. But nonetheless, uh, we're going to do an unboxing, show you what's inside the box. Then we'll talk about the material and the different components and some specific information about the unit itself. Then we get into the installation, operation, and is it really fun or worth it? Let's get to it. So inside the box, when you open it up first, you get uh, this accessory box that you get a few things in this. And you also have these kind of like non-slip uh, socks that they have included, which I think was a really good touch. Then you have the mat itself. Uh, it's folded nicely. As you can see, I have this laid out on the table right now to kind of like show the massive size of this thing and how large it is. This is not a inky dinky small uh, dance mat. This is some serious stuff that you get. Once you open up the accessory box, uh, you are provided with an HDMI cable. Uh, you do get a charging brick and a USB cable. One thing uh, you need to be mindful of the USB cable. This is a unique USB cable, a little bit. It's a USB-A to USB-A and they both end are male ends. This is, I think, also referred to as data transfer USB cable. So make sure don't lose this one. If you do, you can still buy it on Amazon. Uh, you also get these uh, controllers um, that uh, kind of like motion activated. And then you have like buttons and D-pads and things like that for additional games. And the unit itself, uh, the hub that basically is the brain and uh, has all the IO as well as the built-in camera and the built-in lights. This thing is very meaty. It It is about 15 millimeters thick, if I'm not mistaken, which is about three quarters of an inch. So it is very, very comfortable to step on with barefoot or with just the socks, even on hardwood floor. Back of it, you have a ton of these small little non-slippery uh, dots that would actually help to secure this thing because when you're dancing on it, jumping up and down, moving around, it tends to shift. And when I had this on hardwood floor, it did not move at all. When I played this on a rug towards the end of one song, it literally may have moved by like one inch. So there is some movement on the carpet and on the rug, but not on hardwood floor. The hub itself is very light, it's plasticky, uh, but it does, what um, it says it will do. So you have the on and off button as well as the light button. You have a slot for a TF card, HDMI, and the USB for power. And the camera is in the front that you can flip open and close. I will tell you this uh, camera is a little finicky to open and close. Uh, so just keep in mind, this is where the camera is. The controllers, you have your AB button, you have your start and return button and a D-pad. It detects motion, so if you play like Fruit Ninja on this device, which actually is one of the games, you can use this. This thing takes two AAA batteries, and that's how it operates. And the main device itself, it is powered with the USB cable you have. Setup, honestly, is probably the highlight of this thing, how simple it is. You connect the USB for the power, you connect the HDMI to your TV, and wirelessly, that can communicate with the pad. In the pad, you also have to put, um, I think, uh, let's see, yes, two AAA batteries, and there is an on switch. There is an on and off switch on the pad itself at the top of it. You flip that on, you flip this on, and it instantly connects and communicates. There is no pairing process or anything like that. Uh, when it comes to the operation, 
you can navigate the menus uh, using the pad itself. So you have obviously your up, down, right, left. You also have a select and start button on the pad itself, but you can also use uh, the D pad and this thing and the select and return to try to navigate your way around the navigation and different offerings that this game has. So when it comes to the different things you can do with this pad, you have different options. So obviously at its core, this thing is a dance mat. So you have your dance option. Then they have added a yoga option, um, which I really liked and I'll tell you more about that. And then you have some camera features, you got running features and you have other games that you use with the keyboard. Um, out of all of them, the two things I like the most were the dance features as well as the yoga feature. I wanna tell you about the yoga first because that's a little bit unique. So on each of the pads, you essentially have nine different sensors. The main one you stand on and the eight all the way around it. So you have total of 18 different sensors and when it shows you the yoga positions on the screen, it tells you what you need to do. Um, and uh, it, it kind of notices if you are or are not doing it. For example, if you have to be on your one foot, it detects if <laughs> one sensor is being touched or not. Or if you have to be on your, I don't even know the yoga poses, but if like you're on your, on your belly and you have to lift your legs and, and your head, you should only touch like a couple of sensors and then you, uh, versus if you're laying down flat, you're going to touch an entire row. So I thought that was a very clever way to try to implement yoga into this. When it comes to the dance feature, so the menu gets a little bit interesting. You can play solo and you can play multiplayer with two people. You can do um, four sensors versus six sensors. And then you have two styles of um, gameplay. One, you can have the animations that they do these like dance moves, but they also have a section, they call it, I think like MTV or something. I forgot what, it, what it's called, but you actually have actual top hit licensed music videos. I don't know if <laughs> they, they can or cannot use them, but nonetheless, I think it's pretty cool that they have those. So you have songs like uh, Bad Habits, Faded, Industry Baby, uh, Maroon, Shake It Off, Stack It Up, Stay, and things like that. So I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, also, you're able to update the list of songs that they have. So I'll put a link down in the description below. I'm not gonna go through the instruction. I like the selection of songs that they have. It's actually very fun to play. Uh, it's 70 plus songs, if I'm not mistaken. I was counting that you can have. If you're one of those professional um, dance mat players or whatever you call them, um, some of those like very exotic, extremely fast, extremely difficult that average people like me can never do. Even at its hardest level, which is three stars, um, I could actually play those games. If anything, I enjoyed the three stars myself better. The one stars, I thought it was a little bit too slow for me. But nonetheless, lots of fun with the dancing and lots of fun in the yoga. The camera, the resolution is really low. It's there. Uh, but you shouldn't get it for that feature. The games that you have available, it's there, but you should not buy this because of those games. If you want to get it, you should get this primarily for its dance feature and uh, the yoga feature is just icing on the cake, in my opinion. I personally did not find that it was misregistering my steps, so I found it to be very accurate. It did remind me that I need to start exercising again because I realized quickly how out of shape I was after like literally one song I was <laughs> breathing so hard, but uh, it was very encouraging to try to play that. So first let me tell you about the giveaway instruction and then I'll give you my final conclusion. If you're interested in the drawing and you live in the US, uh, just drop a comment down below and let me know you're interested in the giveaway and you need to be obviously subscribed. And yes, I can see if you're subscribed or not when you drop a comment. And then you need to head over to my Instagram account, send me a DM, just say FWFX. I'm gonna put it somewhere on the screen. And that's all it is. After about six weeks or so, uh, if you get a DM from me, uh, you know you're the winner, very straightforward. So let's get back to the video. What's my final conclusion? So this is a very niche and unique product, right? If you're looking to try to get a dance mat, I was very happy with this, especially with the size. I can let you see how massive this is. Uh, each of the playable squares is 30 inches by 30 inches. And when it comes to the overall dimensions, it's six and a half inches by 37 inches. So that is really, really 
large and it you, two people can comfortably play on it and have no problem uh, when it comes to the material it's very comfortable it's very plushy my understanding is some of the less expensive options they use different materials uh, which may not have uh, the same quality as this one i do have a coupon code uh, down in the description below i think it's going to expire at some point so it's not going to be there forever take advantage of it uh, if you are interested i was a big fan of the camera the running games or the games you play with uh, the controllers but i really 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 like the dance features the dance games and the yoga hopefully that makes sense hopefully that was helpful if you got any particular questions that i did not answer in this video drop a comment down below and again, don't forget to subscribe and turn the bell notification on. I have a lot more videos coming up, most of them, if not all of them, with some sort of giveaway. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.